What's up, y'all? I'm Philip. I'm Micah. Welcome to another video from Goodline Disc Golf. Listen, we got an interesting challenge today. It's called Doomsday. That's right, Doomsday. So today we're playing Doomsday with Doomsday Disc, uh, the seven-speed bunker buster that's bigger than our heads, and the <laughs> what two-speed landmine. Yep. Uh, so these things are are weird. They yeah. are some weird discs. So the rules of Doomsday: if I throw and I beat Philip on a hole. I will keep a life and he'll lose a life. We we both have three lives. Four hearts. Four hearts. Four hearts. Four lives. Yes. Okay, we have four lives. If Hello. Hello. <laughs> uh, keep going. And if we So he loses a life if he if he loses, mm -hmm. I st I keep my heart. Mm -hmm. If we tie, you lose half a heart. Yep. And if you don't use both the disc in one hole, you lose half a heart unless there's an ace or something weird that happens. But you got to use both both disc and there is a special disc for the loser of each hole. They get the dystopia. We've never thrown any of these discs. Yes, never thrown a single one. So we'll, we'll see how this goes. We'll get to review Doomsday Disc after this. <laughs> Here we go. You think it's flippy? I don't know. Let's find out. Ooh, not bad. It's actually got a pretty good flight. Uh, a little. It's got a toe in though. Oh yeah, definitely flip. Oh, yours is way flippier than mine. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I threw mine on more hyzer. I don't know if you can see that through my body, but that was flippy. <laughs> All right. Upon first throw of that, what do you think? Uh, flippy fairway that feels like a condor with a leopard. <laughs> <laughs> Leopard on the inside, condor on the top. It's weird, man. It is, though I like it. Too bad it's not uh, PDGA approved yet. Either I've got all the power, or Mike is, the red is not as flippy as the white, but we'll find out. Um, the white looks better for sure. But it's weird throwing a, like a, a small rim with that big of a disc. Yeah, it is. <laughs> You're good. About 100 out. This is going in. Maybe a little more than 100. I think I'm going to lose a heart. <laughs> I think you are too. <laughs> I hope so. I'm about 45. <laughs> oh, that's a, that wasn't great. That's half a life for each for both of us. It's like I'll just tap mine out. Yeah, I got this. FPV, first person. There you go. <laughs> All right, hold two. About 270, hard dog leg to the right. You can go straight at it, um, which is a lot of people do, but I'm scared of. Or you can go around. Um, let's see. None of us won the dystopia. We both lost half a heart. So let's do the thing. Oh, he went straight at it. That's what you get. <laughs> you went straight at it, I'm going. Going the forehand route. I love the forehand route, but. Oh my gosh. Not terrible. The landmine is starting to rain down, so hopefully we can finish this thing. But I threw the landmine to start, so I've got to putt with this giant thing. Yeah, you're also probably closer than me, but. Oh well. <laughs> Just as bad putting with this as the landmine. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I've I, used them both. I think you're losing a heart. <laughs> we'll see. See, I saved my putter for the actual putting part. <laughs> Too bad you can't put it. You're right, but I have a better chance than you. We're the same distance away, by the way. I'm just behind the tree. I hate this rim for like putting. Yeah, it feels awful. Well, this is gonna be my wife. My wife wanted this disc, and I already put it in. Oops.
That's right. That's right. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> Need that mark. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Hole three, 198 feet, par three. Landmine should be easy. Famous last word. You better park it. Man, that thing doesn't fly. Flies weird. All right, I unlocked the dystopia for losing that hole, so we're gonna try it out this hole. Probably too much disc, but. Under 200 feet, we'll distance work driver. Out. We'll work it out. It's, it's a fairway. Fairway, oh, okay. Kobe. It's flippy. <laughs> <laughs> Never even had a chance. <laughs> what do you got put with? The big boy. That's what I'm calling it. It's like me. Bunker Buster is a big boy? Yeah. Oh, this thing's awful. <laughs> no oh, way. <laughs> no it goes way. In every time. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, we're coming up on hole four. Phillip's already at one and a half arts. So, you know, just because I love him. Let's, re let's regenerate one of your hearts. You're back up two and a half. There you are. You're back up to two Does and a half. Does that put you four and a half? No, no, no. Oh, okay. I'm staying where I am. Okay. Yeah. I'm just giving you an extra heart. That's oh. how much, that's how I'm much, I am better. Than two and a half to three and a half. <laughs> three and okay. a half. There you are. You're up to three and a half. We're All starting right. hole four. 192 feet. Real easy. I'm throwing this big boy fairway, even though I should be putting with it after that last one. Going for a little skip shot. Oh, it, it, it was bad. I didn't skip it at all. Oh, but it's good. I hit a tree. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm gonna throw the putter off the tee, and I'm telling you, this thing is weapons grade destroyed. <laughs> Four handed. Forearming it. Oh boy. Yep. Yep. Oh my gosh, it's actually good. I have a chance. <laughs> All I have to do is putt. Too bad I don't have my putter. I have this landmine thing. <laughs> landmine thing? Yeah. <laughs> thing. It's, it's literally a child's toy. I don't know. <laughs> miss it and let him have a chance to come back. Here's, he's Philip approaching his lie. He's putting with a fairway. Oh my gosh. <laughs> seems like the key to winning like a hole I just beat my cut for that hole he's still ahead by like half a heart I think um, <laughs> the key is to throw with the put putter and and put with the driver dystopia went right in there anyway this next hole is about 200 feet 180 feet just straight ahead you see it um, but I'm going with the putter to start <clears throat> I think you have to Unless you do that. <laughs> I'm going dystopia. It's my first time having it, so why not? Phil told me it. he thinks it's flippy. It's probably super overstable and he's lying to me playing mind games. We'll see. Ah. Ooh. It tried to go OB. I don't think it did. Okay, so I don't have to go with the bunker buster. Like, I think I might want to approach with the landmine and then just go for the tie. But if I accidentally throw the landmine in, then I lose half a heart. But you lose a whole heart. I'm going with the landmine. 
Make this video competitive again. Make it in. No way. That was so close. That was so close. Hold up. He almost went OB with this. Almost, but I didn't. Getting that relief. He's got to have it. Oh my. There's a tree right in my way. <laughs> what are you putting with? Landmine. Oh, boom. The putter. Yeah, the putter. <laughs> no way. No way. <laughs> Never. Not with <sighs> Tapping mine in FPV. Was it nerve wracking that you had to do the tap in with your third disc, the bunker buster? No, because this is the better putter of, the, <laughs> of all the discs. This is the best putter. All right, so my plan went according to plan. Everything went according to plan. We tied that hole, which keeps us tied. And Micah loses the dystopia, so he doesn't get it. He doesn't get to throw it because he didn't lose the last hole. He only tied it. So we're tied at two. Here's hole six, and here's where I just take the lead. It's a straight shot, just right there, down the tunnel. Um, 275 feet straight down the tunnel. It's kind of a turnover shot or a forehand shot, but we'll see. We're going bunker buster, baby. I don't know where that went. I think yours is flippier than mine. Bunker Buster. Let's see how it goes. Hopefully better than Phillips. <laughs> basically the same, I think. Yeah, basically the same. Basically the same. Ooh, who got outdriven? Micah did. <laughs> I thought for a sec. <laughs> Do you think you're going to make it? Throwing this in. Taking the lead here. He's going to roll down the hill. I thought that was going in. <laughs> it's going in the circle as well. Oh. Used them all, used all the disc. All right. We tied that hole, so we're back to one and a half hearts a piece. I'm not giving any extra hearts the way Micah did. Um, <laughs> so I'm trying to win this thing. So this, this hole has two positions, like a few of them out here. You got short, straight, easier, and you got hard to the right, where you have, and they both have to do a double mando. So we're gonna go hard. We're going hard in the paint. Both of us have to use both disc. I'm going with the bunker buster. I think I'm gonna bust out a roller. Bust out a roller. I'm not. That's way over there. Did the head? <laughs> there must be a tailwind. There's, there's a tailwind. I'm going landmine. Oh. And I'm going forearm roller. Okay. Because I've seen Philip do it. All you have to do is is like part of this hole you'll probably win it yeah okay but I'd rather do this because it's more fun <laughs> I'm gonna fail okay well not terrible nope right in the middle not great but not that terrible. disc is probably dead though <laughs> yeah I broke the disc <laughs> all right here no guts no glory at this point I can throw whatever I want because there's no way I'm going in I went way off the beaten path here. I'm not even close to the fairway. So, yeah, I kind of wish we were going to the straight one. Yeah, you parked, you almost parked the straight one. <laughs> Too bad we're not. Believe it or not, believe it or not, I've got a lane. Yeah, it's not the short basket either. Yeah, yeah, it's not the short. It's another, what, 100 feet that way? Going in. Going in. Black ace of short basket. <laughs> No. 
Oh, come on. How did it get through those? It went through the trees. <laughs> One of us have to win this thing, Micah. Just throw yeah, it in. Be me. Yeah. Um, I think with where you landed, all I have to do is par this. So. <laughs> you, I can't make that putt? No. I can use either disc. Yeah, I don't, it doesn't matter. <laughs> so I'm just going to lay up with the landmine because that's totally the best option to do. So I have it. A little long. I didn't do myself any favors. <laughs> now you have to hit a putt with the bunker buster. Uh, that, like I, that was my plan. <laughs> the bunker buster is the putter <laughs> out of these two. Nope. The You're gonna make this putt with the bunker buster? All right, look. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm, using, I'm using the landmine. I'm using the landmine. I'm gonna use the bunker buster as a giant mini. Have you thrown the bunker buster? Yep, I threw it off the tee. Oh yeah, I haven't thrown the bunker buster. Nope. I threw the landmine twice. Like a boom. Wow, this, this thing has a bubble in it already. You, you can't get it up. <laughs> <laughs> the rim is like this. It's not straight. It like flares out a little bit. Yeah, so it's, it's concave, right? Yeah. It's weird. But as you see, he missed. I missed my chance. Mike has got a chance here to make a putt with the bunker buster. number eight. Phillip's about to lose off this hole. All we have to do is uh, throw it 228 feet, slight little turnover shot, and uh, and we're all good. If we both lose all of our hearts, we're going to go into a sudden death. First to win a hole wins. Uh, but that doesn't matter because I'm about to beat Phillip. So. Oh, that's a... Uh, that's a cut roller, out of the woods, almost. Not great. <laughs> it feels like every decision with these discs right now, especially in like with all the trees, is a bad decision. But I'm gonna forearm the landmine. That is a bad decision. <laughs> against the headwind. Oh my gosh, it's actually so good. Never mind. It it's not. Fly. No, it doesn't. It just falls. <laughs> How do you feel about it? I feel like these discs are like, I feel like they're useless. I love you. Di like, thank you for sending us. I love the, <laughs> I love the brand. I think it's super cool. Doomsday disc, but man, these discs that we're using right now, there's no way in the world I would ever put them in my, in my bag. <laughs> I might throw the landmine in there. No. <laughs> Like You're gonna throw it in the, with the bunker buster. Okay. You know, they always say it's not the disc, it's the archer. In this case, it's kind of right still, but <laughs> <laughs> these discs are way different than any disc you normal. Oh, good tree. Parked? Parked. You could still miss that. No. Parked. Yeah, if you use the landmine. <laughs> and the wind picks up as I step up to my line. That's right. Throw in the landmine because I'm trying to put it in and go ahead and end Philip. You throw this in, you win. Yeah, let's, let's just end this video. Oh. Nope. Parked it though. I'm parked. I'm good. So I'm gonna miss this right here. Game time. Oh. Just kidding. Left handed bag on. Woo. I thought I was gonna push out. Alright, hole nine. We're both at half a heart. Coming down to the wire. I don't feel good about a sudden death, just to be completely honest. <laughs> so I just gotta park this. It's not gonna happen, but I gotta park this. What are you throwing? Bunker Buster, 245, kinda. Kind of straight, but you have to kind of put some hyzer on it to get it around the trees. 
Let's see how it goes. Not well. Probably. Ooh, okay. flippy. Oh, oh. oh, that was bad. That was so flippy. Alright, I'm going for the win, so I'm just going to try to put this in play so we can end this thing. I know that's boring, but that's what I'm doing. Bunker Buster, baby. Oh my goodness. No way. I'm going to have to... <laughs> I'm gonna have to put it right up there. <laughs> Thanks. Come down to this. He, has, I can lay this up. he can lay this up to win. But he's gonna run it. No layups here. I don't birdie this hole with my regular bag. He yeah, uh, he never birdies this no, hole. No, I birdie it sometimes, but No no, he never don't don't it's a technical shot off the tee. Cool birdie. With the bunker buster and the landmine. You making the swap? 2023 putter, landmine. Definitely. Definitely. So I had to get an extra life. I found an extra life. <clears throat> Micah gave me an extra life. Appreciate that, Micah. Yeah, you're welcome. Um, and I birdied. <laughs> I didn't have to birdie, but I birdied a hole that I generally never birdie. It's actually a pretty hard hole um, out here, even though it's only 250 feet. Uh, yeah, so I got the dub. Doomsday came to Micah. Doomsday. <laughs> <laughs> hey, like, comment, subscribe. We're going to be giving away a... Uh, we're going to be giving away a... What are we giving away? We're going to be giving away a six 